Virgo. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. There you are. So keep in mind that the energies can always be reversed. Also remember, it's a general reading. So just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. <clears throat> if it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you'd like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. All right, Virgo, what's coming up? Now you could be dealing with another earth sign. You got the King of Pentacles, the Ace of Swords, the Queen of Pentacles. And there's water energy. So signs, not really. Um, there's a whole lot down there. All right, immediate future. What's coming up for Virgo, please? We got the Temperance card, Sagittarius energy, the Three of Pentacles. And the page of wands. Well, overall, it, it kind of feels like, um, oh shit, in the background is more where the story is. You got the five of swords, the five of, I'm sorry, the five of pentacles, the five of cups, the three of swords. There's like an apology back here or somebody wanting to. This is a painful energy. A lot of like regret, hurt, pain, loneliness, separation, guilt. Anyways, right here, it's kind of a different story. Um, you got the temperance card again, Sagittarius energy. That's about patience, healing, kind of taking care of self, going with the flow um, type energy. Patience is needed with that. For the obstacle, you have the three of pentacles. So the three of pentacles is about like making plans, working together, creating a partnership. And you got the page of wands. So it's kind of like a still energy to a not as still energy show me this temperance card please for virgo the king of swords could be dealing with the air sign doesn't have to this could be somebody that things have either been real chill or you could have healed from this is not necessarily the type of energy that's just been voicing their opinions the Knight of Pentacles, that's your Earth energy. Tell me about the Knight of Pentacles. I mean, over here, the, the biggest thing coming across the Four of Swords again is healing. And it kind of just taking a day by day, a very slow moving energy. You literally have the Temperance and the Four of Swords. So this is almost like an energy that's kind of just been taking their time, maybe even slow to speak up to say anything this is just somebody who's done a lot of healing over there show me this three of pentacles for virgo please it's almost like there's a lot of truth or not even truth like clarity that needs to come out you got the queen of cups that is water energy and that knight of cups this is somebody approaching in a very loving way. You definitely could have more, yeah, choices. Because it's basically like a standstill energy. One that has just kind of not really been speaking up about emotions too much. More so doing some healing. And now it's like wanting to make plans. This could be somebody that you work with or even like if it's around work, some type of collaboration or partnership. But this is somebody approaching like in a, a really sweet way. The feelings are here. They're real. There could be a friendship that was there as well. But um, it's progress. So show me this page of wands, please, for Virgo. Uh oh, too many. Page of Wands for the outcome for Virgo. That is way too many. 
For some, this definitely could be like a Ronda work collaboration or something like that. You got the Page of Wands and the Two of Cups, if that's the case. Um, either way, th there's feelings around this. And like, if it is around work, you could be doing something like creative in nature, something like that. But um, it's interesting how the feelings are coming across. Like somebody's showing a whole lot more interest and kind of speaking up there and curiosity is kind of <clears throat> peak shoot they all just want to fall out uh peeking on someone's it feels like the masculine side oh look this is basically what it is there's a situation where feelings are here but there is like some disappointment so we started with the healing right then we started with somebody you know, wanting to approach you, wanting to make plans, work together. It could be a decision, but it, it just feels like um, while somebody really wants that with the Five of Cups and the Two of Cups here, there can still be a situation where things don't, there, there can be like some disappointment or some letdown. But the biggest thing with this is like looking at the whole picture. Like even don't focus on like the things that may not be working like the way you exactly hoped. Because these two cups are still back here standing. Like the feelings are really real. So, and you know, we have the nine of swords. So we went through all this healing, all this kind of slow recovery energy, the things progressing to a man, like a, a, a more so of like a feelings type thing. The feelings are there, and somebody wants to move forward, but they get caught in their head. Why the Five of Cups, though? Because this is like a, this is telling you to look at things, look at the whole picture. Why is the Five of Cups there? You got the Fool. So with the Fool there, that that um, is about taking a chance, taking a leap of faith. It's this Two of Wands. So it's almost like when it comes to that Two of Wands somebody gets stuck when it comes to taking that making that next move because it may require somebody to step outside their comfort zone it, it's this is coming across like an energy that's um that's hurting but they're not saying anything they're trying to apologize because the feelings are immensely there but at the same time i didn't see that queen of swords down there they, they're not sure where you stand when it comes to apologizing. They know they let you down. And the apology is coming and it's legit. But you're kind of also, or vice versa, in this energy of like going to protect your heart as well around this. All right, Virgo. I hope this helped. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. You guys take care and I'll see you next time.